Hey everyone, it's Libby from Master Tarot. I'd like to acknowledge the Waramai First Nations people and thrilled to have you, your guides, my guides, and the Universal Energies with us today. I am drawing on those energies quite uh, substantially today um, as full of a head cold, uh, not helped by, uh, we've literally gone from uh, steamy tropical conditions to snow down to 800 metres and it's very bitter outside, very windy at the moment. Okay, positive news, um, uh, Turkey has uh, called Russia's bluff combined with the um, UN and NATO and grain is moving out of um, Ukraine through the Black sea, to, Black sea to those countries that really need it. Uh, 354,000 tonnes was moved yesterday, I believe. So yes, that's fantastic news. And fabulous news with uh, uh, De Silva, um, Lula De Silva winning the um, Brazilian election despite allegedly and entertainment only uh, the uh, the um, corruption and 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 cheating and bribery etc etc taken on by the other party now um, bolsonaro hasn't admitted defeat he hasn't conceded however his uh, chief of staff uh, has advised the media that bolsonaro has told the Chief of Staff to begin the transition process. So I think he, he is not going to concede publicly, but uh, he, knows, he knows what's going on. Okay, I'm going to have a look. So as, as mentioned yesterday, I'm going to have a more of an in-depth look about the future of the Amazon rainforest. So vital for the health of this country. When I read prior to the Brazilian elections, I really saw that it was vital for um, Lula da Silva to win and that he will actually um, uh, take steps to restore the rainforest. He will take back lands that Bolsonaro has given to his cronies um, and just has been cleared. So he, these lands will come back um, under protection and they will be replanted and reinstated. So that's what I got um, a month or so ago and again just uh, the other week. So I'm just going to have a look at a, um, a little bit of a more in depth um, to see how that's going to go, see if we can get some, um, I'm not going to get a timing on it, but I just want to just get some clarification cards for it massive clearing um, just anyhow so these these this rainforest a it is vital for um, combating climate control uh, or, or just maintaining a, a control of the climate on our planet earth for removing carbon from the atmosphere but also the amount of um, medicines that are being discovered in these in these um, rainforests is just phenomenal. Uh, the positive um, uh, herbs and nutrients that are coming out, but also on the negative, you start clearing in wholesale clearing like has been going on, and you end up with situations like in China with uh, COVID erupting so i'm just going to have a look sorry if i'm a little bit disjointed today <laughs> line my sharp make sure my chakra is lined and lit draw on source energy draw on the universal energy fill this space Okay, boys aren't talking to me today. <laughs> they were going absolutely nuts yesterday. They enjoyed yesterday's reading. Okay, tell me about, tell me about just going forward now that Lula da Silva has won the election. What's fallen out is the Seven of Wands. Just, we're just going to have to take a moment 
Um, Seven of Wands is often defending oneself, um, but what I'm really getting here is all these, um, this moment has occurred and we just need to step back and take a moment. Now these are my Light Seers Tarot. These are the cards that I use for family and friends. And I consider the Amazon rainforest a, a, a very, very close friend and and uh, so important for Mother Earth. Okay, cards falling out everywhere, which is just my terrible shuffling. So just tell me how Lula de Silva is going to go forward in his presidency in regards to the Amazon rainforest. Lula de Silva and the Amazon rainforest. Oh, they did not want to go back in. Okay, I'll just um, do these three cards. I am going to do a full uh, Celtic cross, and then I'm going to use my intuition cards. But these three cards did not want to go back in. So let's have a look. Um, four of Cups. So there is this immense disappointment at what has been lost already. However, in this particular deck, I'm always drawn to this cup that is still receiving this full full um, bloom of radiation. Now, yesterday I was driving, massive storm came over, the most brilliant rainbow uh, was in front of me, literally down the road. I was driving all the way home, driving home for an hour. So I literally followed this brilliant rainbow all the way home and it was glorious and it reminds me of this. This cup is still full. There is this disappointment at what has been lost, what has been emptied. But we need to look at this, at this side of the cup. This is, um, in, in a lot of the lovers, in a lot of the decks, the lovers card is about an unequal relationship, but this is not, that's not true in this deck. This is very much a joint, uh, joint partnership of powerful relationship and absolute passion. Um, and it is very much a, um, together there is greater strength than, than apart in this particular relationship. This is a returning to our spirituality, showing the agenda going forward, but this is just very much becoming in touch with the universal energies and, um, and with Mother Earth itself. So I'll keep shuffling. The High Priestess. This is why I love this deck because it is, that's why I have different decks for different reasons because the different cards show uh, different meanings depending on uh, what deck I am using in regards to the question. So just tell me, full Celtic cross please Master, full Celtic in regards to Lula de Silva and the Amazon Rainforest. Please show me, please show me. Please show me. Lula de Silva, the election of Lula de Silva and the Amazon rainforest. <laughs> okay, two cards came out at me at once, but I will use them both as signifiers. Yep, we are in this moment. We are in this moment of destiny. The wheel has turned. We have rolled the dice. And the wheel has turned. And it is about actions and consequences and this rebalancing. Really powerful uh, signifier cards. Wisdom, the truth, bringing back the truth as we rebalance. Okay, do like that. <clears throat> Base of this reading, Eight of Swords. Restriction, but the restriction is, it is only a reflection in the mirror. This is about um, uh, mental anxiety causing restriction because the figure that's not in the mirror is not bound, is not blindfolded, but the image they are seeing. So I'm, okay, thank you, Master. <laughs> oh, and Noreen, yes, I know you're here today too. He's, he's, yeah, he's in there as my First Nations spiritual healer, Noreen. 
this is very much telling me that right in the energies right now at the foundations it's going to be a very much oh my god where do we start we are going to feel um, and when I say we I mean the whole world but I am talking about this is Lula de Silva and his administration in regards to the Amazon. They are going to feel restricted about, um, they're going to have to undo. Okay, thank you guys. They're going to have to undo a lot of what Bolsonaro has put into place. And it is very much about where, where do we start? This is such a big project. It's not going to happen overnight. But this is about facing, looking in the mirror, facing ourselves in this mirror and undoing these bindings. Okay. <clears throat> but it is going to be, it is going to be quite a, a, a mental hurdle to get over in the past seven of swords. Why am I not surprised to see this? This is the sabotage, betrayal, win at all costs, greed, um, uh, uh, plundering for the sake of, of plundering, uh, pl plundering for the sake of greed, um, killing um, for um, self purposes. Uh, but this is in the past. I'm very pleased to see that's in the past. Okay, crowning the reading Queen of Cups. Love it. Love it. Look at her seated in this. In both in the water and in the air, which m reminds me of tropical rainforest, moist and 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 clean air. But she is embracing both the water and the air, and she's bringing the two together emotionally. Um, and there is something in her cup that is is going to be revealed in regards to this. You can see the streaming out of the cup here, but I just love this. This is calm diplomatic bringing together of all the elements, all the elements necessary in regards to this. I do like that. Love it. Okay. Immediate future. Three of Pentacles. A solid foundation is going to have to be built in regards to this, but this is, this is about the communities working together to make it happen. And building this together, creating, thank you guys, creating this together. It's not, it's not simply building, it is recreating this together. But it is a solid foundation in the immediate future. I do like that. Okay, externally, boundaries being set. There's going to be, thank you, there's going to be legal, world, uh, uh, UN, UN, worldwide, I'm getting worldwide, I've got universal to start with, so I don't know whether our, our off-planet friends are going to help in this, um, but there is going to be, um, okay, I'll say it, universal protection boundaries put in place to protect going forward that's externally internally it's not going to be easy it's going to be a lot of obstacles to overcome however um, there is this reach for this passionate flame this flame's not burning the rainforest this is a flame of passion to make it work but there are going to be obstacles there's going to be powerful entities that have been given free reign have been literally given um given land, given uh, what they believe, even though they were illegal, rights to just log to their pleasure. Um, so there are obstacles going to be, have to be overcome. <clears throat> Hopes and fears, w wisdom, strength, calmness, intelligence, overseeing the realm, with um yeah just just this is the hope that we will enter this feminine energy of intellect and and um 
truth saying and strength and compassion and wisdom protection watching out over and protecting outcome ten of swords now in many decks this is the ten swords in the back it does and can mean complete and utter downfall however in this particular deck and this is why I'm using this deck at this time because this is um, has such vibrant imagery that is different to many of the other tarot decks. Tens are the end of a cycle. And in this particular deck, this figure, female, feminine energy figure, is standing on the cusp of the ridge, looking out at the new sunrise. As the crows, ravens, blackbirds, whatever they may be, are flying overhead, to this new beginning. So we're leaving behind what has gone before and we are facing a new sunrise. So it is about an ending of what has been, ending of what has been, and moving into a new beginning. I do like that. Nine of Pentacles. Uh, <clears throat> this is about the Garden of Eden. Independence financial assistance, financially strong. Okay, thank you. So, okay, thank you. The, what they're telling me is there's something about this protection of the rainforest that is going to financially strengthen Brazil. Not sure quite why. Danny Shea was reading very powerfully about ecotourism becoming a major earner for the country. Um, but this is very much about... Um, health thank you health of this garden health bringing wealth thank you love it stepping forward trusting the universe stepping forward on a new journey in faith and hope and trusting that the universe will catch you which it will and then we have the sun I don't think I could have ended that any better, to be honest. Magic is going to happen. It is going to be a bit of a juggling act. Uh, it is about protecting what is already, protecting the health of what is already there. Moving on to the expansion, then we have the Queen of Wands, an inspiring, confident figure. The youth, again, a wand inspired going back to how it was in the past and simplicity and there is a plan there is a plan that will come to fruition but I do love these two ending outcome cards <coughs> so I think it's going to be okay uh, there, there is it's not going to be easy there are obstacles that are going to have to overcome there is this um, removing of the blindfold and the bindings that is going to have to take place uh, so it's not going to happen instantly but I do like the fact that uh, there is going to be international protection of the rainforest in, in universal thank you guys they keep saying universal it's not not uh, just uh, a UN basis it is a universal protection okay I'm going to use my intuition cards just to go through a story here <clears throat> just to see the process that they will go through if you haven't seen my intuition cards these are cards that Meister and I have drawn up together I do not know how many cards there are <laughs> there are it's a lot <clears throat> but we do go through a very um, detailed and complex story as we go forward sorry this reading's turning out a bit longer than I thought it would be oh well I did say I would do in depth okay let's have a look tell me about the future of the Amazon rainforest the Congo is just as important in Africa as well but tell me about the and future of the Amazon rainforest under De Silva, under the De Silva, Lula De Silva administration and going forward and going forward because it does not end with him. Tell me about going forward.
<laughs> popped out, popped out up. It's 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 going to be good. It's going to be upward movement. <clears throat> okay. You ready for me to start, guys? Yes, they are telling me. So they've popped two cards out to start with. So I'll bring you down and we'll go through the story. Um, it's going to be hard work. Hard work is going to be the key. There is no two ways about it. Uh, there is going to have to be um, outside help. Oh, okay, thank you, guys. Sometimes I get my cards a bit muddled. Hard work is going to be the key going into the future. Right. So first line. Hard work is going to be the key going into the future. There will be some conflict. There will be some, some restrictions. But yes, the bravery of moving forward, of the international, on the international scene. Did I need another one on there? No, not yet. So this is the first line. This is setting the foundation. Hard work is the key into the future. There is going to be obstacles and conflict in regards to this that is going to bring about some restrictions because them that have been given free range are not going to give it up easy. But yes, the bravery of... <clears throat> the international will step in. Okay. Right, I do like that. It had me worried for a second there. Uh, there will be anger. This is going to cause anger. But the empty soul that is causing the destruction at the moment is going to stop. Have faith. Take the leap of faith. Take the leap of faith. There will be a lot of fear in the noise that surrounds this, but the abundance is coming in. Okay. Convoluted path. This is, this is a deliberately blank card because it just tells me that this particular step has not been written. So it's going to be a convoluted path forward. It's not going to be straightforward. They're not going to just take the land back and uh, plant plant uh, the the um, uh, the um, the undergrowth and the trees and stuff back in there. It's not the convoluted path is not yet written. But this is all about families. Uh, technology coming together, working together. <clears throat> working together, subtracting this jester messaging, suggester messaging. Trust, trust the majority. Oh, I do like this. So trust the people. Despite the allegedly and uh, entertainment only, uh, corruption, cheating, um, uh, bribery, blackmail, etc. that went f that came forward on the on the, from the Bolsonaro side, uh, the people came out in enough numbers to make this change happen. So trust the people. What is going to go be put out, and this is telling me bullseye, flat out, straight on, fair income. What's going to be bullseyed out is this money, the money, the greed, the, the wealth. And they're not going to be happy about it, to be honest. But we then have this new beginning of full illumination and good overcoming and there is your scales of justice again actions consequences rebalancing on the base of the the pack we have here we have transformation coming forward dragonfly a rebirth transform this is my transformation card 
on a world scale in time. So it will take time. It's not going to happen overnight. Be patient. We've got to get through this convoluted path forward. But, but this um, greed and abundance will become alien. Will become alien. I don't even need those two cards. They don't want me to put those two cards out. Thank you, guys. They're just telling me, put them back. Because that is, we've done enough. We've done enough. So transformation on a world scale. And what's what's happening is I'm really, I'm really positive that this, this, move towards renewable is hitting a tip is very soon going to hit a tipping point so it might seem slow at the moment but the technology is advancing so quickly uh, the changeover is happening so quickly despite what the fossil lovers um, are declaring that we are going to reach this tipping point. So there's going to be transformation on a world scale that will happen in time. And it will happen in time um, for, um, <clears throat> for the sake of the planet. It will be timely. For, this is timely for the planet. But I do like this as the final three cards. Joy. Um, uh, good angelic what however you want to put it um, the universe universal spirits and then the rebalancing okay so if you've got any questions or is there anything you'd like me to read on please pop them in the comments below but I do like that there's going to be so there's going to be some pushback I mean they're not going to give it up <laughs> the, these dudes are not going to and, and and their empty souls are not going to give it up easily but they will have no choice um, because they have been given carte blanche to rape and pillage for the sake of greed and, and money so they're not going to give it up easily there's going to be some obstacles it's going to be a convoluted path this path has not yet been written but the future is positive and it will be Transform transformative for the world in a timely manner. So thank you for joining me. Take care. Love to you all. Breathe deeply. Plant a tree if you uh, have a yard. If you don't have a yard, um, I've got uh, vegetables growing on my... I've got a yard. <laughs> I've got a yard full of fruit trees, um, including a coffee tree. Uh, but uh, I have also um, vegetables such as lettuces and stuff growing on my kitchen windowsill. So, and indoor plants galore. So uh, embrace, embrace nature. Get out into it. Uh, do what you can to encourage nature to recover. And rest assured that the Amazon is in good hands. Thank you for joining me. Love a positive outcome. Look after yourselves, be patient, take care and just uh, express that positivity um, in all aspects of your life. Thank you. Bye-bye.